hello guys so normally we have the requirement that we need to track some uh, some uh, need uh, of the client address see normally the people who are all assessing in our site we need to uh, normally track their IP so with the IP we can uh, think about that is it uh, the client f basically from uh, uh, the place of uh, UK US or uh, normally this guy is assessing the more of uh, our site a lot of uh, purpose we are uh, basically uh, need to track the client address so how to track is that today's topic that I going to show you it's very simple so normally with the request benefits so whatever the people uh, request so under the request uh, process we can uh, get all the benefit of that so normally uh, the under the request the MEC DLL is providing uh, to capture uh, the client address the IP address so how to get that one is a topics that I going to show you today it's very simple the online of code so I just uh, go and add it in a view data I just uh, mention as client IP okay so here under the request see because uh, this is the process of request so basically request uh, is uh, from inherited from the HTTP request base that is from the controller controller base you will get a request dot client sorry uh, user host address so by getting the user host address you will uh, get the details of uh, the client IP so uh, let uh, add this in my view to check uh, what is the IP that I going to get the on the load of uh, the particular uh, page so normally this I am adding you can add it uh, in anywhere that wherever you want to track so uh, default I added in my home page index action so on hit of uh, index action I will um, get the client IP here by getting uh, uh, by using request dot user host address so let me again uh, build my application so it is attaching my request uh, into the IAS so here I'm using Visual Studio 2017 okay finally yes my breakpoint is heated so uh, if you see uh, yes it's uh, showing me that double uh, colon one what is it uh, double colon one because uh, this is my machine that a machine uh, has no IP and this is the local host first of all so if you host this application in IAS or in your server then you will have the track of uh, your network IP so because this is my internal IP uh, in internal um, system that is a local host so I am getting the default this so if you get this yes you are using the local host so same application you go and uh, build and publish and uh, host it in a server and you get the real IP of the client machine thanks for watching the video guys if you have any doubt queries on this please comment us if you not subscribe our channel before please subscribe our channel you have the button in